Hey everyone, thanks for joining me once again and welcome back to another Jibber Jab review. Now for today's show, I have two completely free watch faces to share with you guys and from a brand new developer of the show. And I love to be able to share not only new designs with you guys, but also new developers. In fact, this designer actually only has a total of four watch faces in his collection. So I'm gonna be showing you essentially half of them right now. And if these are any indication of what we can expect from this developer, then then I think we should all be really excited. And as usual, I'm gonna leave the direct links to these watch faces so you can easily pick them up in the App Store. But for now, let's have a quick peek of what you get with these two really nice designs. Okay, now both of these watch faces are basically the same in their look. There are a couple minor differences between the two, which you're gonna see in the video here. But the main difference, of course, is the color scheme, with one of them having a mainly white background with black markers, and then the other version is the opposite, in that you have a monochrome background with some really bright white markers. And I think both look equally nice, especially if you happen to be someone that likes clean, simple, and minimalist style watch faces, because there really isn't a lot of data on the display here, which is actually okay because the style of these designs is more in the luxury and elegant category. So I wouldn't expect to see a lot of information in this kind of design anyways. Okay, so what you do have on the display here is the date, which is shown at the bottom of the watch face, followed by a battery power remaining dial off to the left hand side. And then off to the right is a 24 hour clock. And like I said, both of these faces are basically the same. The only difference you're gonna see here is on the black watch face where you actually have text next to your dials. But both designs here contain the same functionality and features. Now, personally, I like the white and the black combination a little bit more, just because it kind of reminds me of a stormtrooper from Star Wars. And not that they would have any need for a smartwatch, of course, but the color scheme is really cool and I love the contrasting aspects of it. And finally, both of these come optimized with a lovely loom effect for your AOD mode. All right, guys, that's just a quick recap of these two freebies from this new developer to the show. And remember to click on our direct links to them down below in our video description if you do want to add them to your accounts because, hey, I think they look pretty snazzy and there's no harm in checking them out when there's no cost either, so you might as well have a look. Thanks again for watching our review and for supporting the channel. And please keep hitting that like button and, of course, subscribe to the channel if you are enjoying our content. I'll see you guys in our next video. Until then, take care. Thanks again for watching our review, and if you liked it, then show us some love with a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and share the video with your friends, because with your support, it really helps me keep the channel going, so I can continue to offer you guys discounts, giveaways, and of course, fresh content. I'll see you in the next episode. Until then, take care.